hello guys welcome again to my channel today's video we want to solve another math problem which read 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equal to 640 and we are looking for the possible value of a and b so please if you are new here kindly subscribe and by the time you subscribe please don't forget to turn on the notification button so that you get notified anytime i drop videos on math so let's see how we can solve uh, the value of a and b in just this single challenge so let's do that so for sure we want to solve this uh we can see solution see solution okay then we'll write the question uh, which says 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equals to 640 okay having done this we can say 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is also equals to remember the 640 is also equals to 64 times times 10 so in place of 640, we can say 64 times what? Times 10. Okay? We can say 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equal to... Instead of us using this multiplication sign, let's use a bracket to represent this, this multiplication sign. So we can say 64 open bracket 10 close bracket. Right? So we are now having 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equal to... Your 64 is equal to 2 to the power of 6. So we should put that here, we can say 2 to the power of 6, open brackets, 10, close brackets. So haven't done this, haven't done this, so we are now having 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equal to 2 to the power of 6 times 10, a close bracket. Okay? Okay. We are now having 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equal to 2 to the power of what? Of 6. Recall we are having 10 and our 10 is equal to 5 times 2. Okay, so we can say open bracket 5 times 2, close bracket. So we're now having 2 to the power of A, 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equal to 2 to the power of 6 times 5 times 2. Recall this 2 is also equal to 2 to the power of 1. So 2 to the power of 2 is also equal to 2 to the power of 1. So in this place we can put 1 here. 2 to the power of 1. So having done this, having done this, this is 2, 2 to the power of 6. So having done this, we can see that this and this, they have the same basis. And according to the principle of indices, if we are having the same basis, we add the power numbers together. So which says, if you are having a to the power of b times a to the power of c, it's also equals to a to the power of b plus c. So if we succumb to this, to this rule, here, we are having this to be 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equals to 2 to the power of 6 plus 1 times times 5. Okay? We are now having this. So we can say 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equals to 2. 6 plus 1 is going to give us 7. 7 times what? Times times 5. Okay. Haven't done this. Haven't done this. What are we simply going to do? We can say 2 to the power of A plus... 2 to the power of b is equal to 2 to the power of 7, open bracket. Recall my 5 is equal to 4 plus 1. So I can say 5 is also equal to 4 plus 1, right? So I can say 4 plus 1, close the bracket. So I'm not having, I'm not having this. I'm not having this. I'm not having this. So let's solve for that. But since I'm not having 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equal to 2 to the power of 7, open bracket 4, plus 1, close bracket, and we say 4 plus 1 is going to give us what? Our 5 back, right? So we can write this to be 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of B is equals to 2 to the power of 7, open bracket, 4 plus, recall, your 1 is also equal to 2 to the power of 0. So 2 to the power of 0 is going to give us what? 1. So we can write 2 to the power of 0, close bracket. But at this point, we are not going to add it. We are not adding it. So I can, can have this to be 2 to the power of A plus 2 to the power of b is equals to, if we should open the bracket, we have something like this, 2 to the power of 4, of 7. But before we open the bracket, let's try this in a short form again. 4 is also equal to 2 to the power of 2, right? So we can say 2 to the power of 2 plus 2 to the power of 0, close bracket. So we're now having 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equals to 2 to the power of 7, open bracket, 2 to the power of 2 plus 2 to the power of 0. Okay, this is what we are now having. Haven't done this, haven't done this. 
we can say 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equal to, if we open the brackets, we will now have 2 to the power of 7 times 2 to the power of 2 plus 2 to the power of 7 times 2 to the power of 0. Close the bracket. So since we are now having this, we can say 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equal to 2, this and this will come together, become 7 plus 2 plus 2 to the power of 7 plus 0. Okay? We can say 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equal to 2 to the 7 plus 2 is going to give us 9 plus 2 to the power of 7 plus 0 is going to give us what? 7. So we're now having 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equal to 2 to the power of 9 plus 2 to the power of 7. So by comparison, by comparison, I will say 2 to the power of a is equal to 2 to the power of 9 and 2 to the power of b is equal to 2 to the power of what? Of 7. So this and this will go, this and this will go. So my a is equal to 9 and my b is equal to, is equal to 7. My b is equal to, is equal to 7. So these are my values of a and b. So my a is equal to 9 again. 9 and my b is equal to 7. So let's substitute the value of a and b into our equation to see whether what we have uh, is correct. So let's do that here quickly. Recall we are having 2 to the power of a plus 2 to the power of b is equal to 640, right? And we know a to be 9 and our b to be 7. So we should do that. We are having 2 to the power of 9 plus 2 to the power of 7 is equal to 640. Okay? Let's use a calculator to confirm what we just did. Okay, this is a calculator. This is a calculator. If I should bring the calculator here, I can say 2 2 to the power of what? Of 9 is equals to 512. So 2 to the power of 9 is equals to 512. So we can put 512 here. 512 plus 2 2 to the power of, of 7 so this is 2 to the power of 7 2 to the power of 7 is going to give us what? equals to what? 1 2 8 2, 2 to the power of 7 is equals to 1 2 8 plus 1 2 8 is equals to 6 40 so what are we going to do? we can say 1 2 8 plus plus uh, our 5, 1, 2, 5, 1, 2 is equals to 640. So 640 is equals to 640. So the value of A and B in this nice challenge is correct. So please, if you find this video useful and interesting, please click on the subscription button and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified anytime I drop videos on mathematics. And if you have not hit on the thumbs up button, please do well to do so by hitting on the thumbs up button. Bye for now. God bless you. Jesus loves you. And see you in my subsequent video. Bye bye.